condescending and disrespectful terms that were used on both sides of the subject and media from yesterday's press conference with Chicago Mayor Brandon Johnson. Welcome in. It's Illinois in Focus Daily. I'm Greg Bishop. You can like, subscribe, hit that notification bell each and every weekday morning, waking you up with the latest here with Illinois in Focus Daily and get details and headlines at thecentersquare.com. So Friday, the entire Chicago school board resigned and Monday, Mayor Brandon Johnson held a news conference to talk about new selection of school board appointees. All of this coming just as you've got the first half of the first ever elected school board uh, set to face election November 5th. Uh, then you've got, uh, you know, they're going to be seated uh, and a whole host of business that they're going to have to tackle, including uh, the, the budget shortfall, uh, the pension situation, uh, education outcomes, uh, you've also got uh, the uh, leadership of Chicago Public Schools, how that's going to play out. Uh, so all of that, uh, very fascinating to see this play out. But the Chicago mayor announcing a new school board amid contract talks and budget concerns. So the nominated members are CTU member uh, Deborah Pope, environmental activist, um, a variety of other people, uh, uh, a member of the uh, 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 veteran community, uh, let's see here. We've also got uh, uh, political strategist. Uh, you've got uh, community organizer uh, and uh, and others. So uh, not the entirety of those who resigned, but uh, filling out, uh, I believe, seven of those positions. Uh, and the mayor holding that news conference yesterday, and it got uh, pretty heated right off the bat. Uh, here's some of what he had to say in his opening comments. I am no longer going to accept the status quo. We believe that we can have a world-class system yes. that not only creates sustainable community schools, but a system that embraces the arts, that embraces the trades, that makes sure that our children can participate in sports. We have schools right now who do not have dollars for buses to take their kids to sports events. We have a system right now that can't adequately bus children to the very spaces that they say they I believe in. And so that is, I was elected to fight and fight I am. So uh, the mayor uh, also seeming to, you know, characterize opponents as those who uh, would be similar to the Confederacy during the Civil War back in the 1860s. <laughs> Status quo, the past mistakes that have left our students behind, we're not doing that. And then the so-called exports, mm -hmm. the so-called fiscally responsible stewards mm -hmm. are making the same argument when our people wanted to be liberated and emancipated in this country. Mm -hmm. The argument was you can't free black people because it would be too expensive. You they said that it would be fiscally irresponsible for this country to liberate black people. And now you have detractors making the same argument of the Confederacy when it comes to public education. And a pretty incredible uh, juxtaposition there he made. Uh, so uh, questions came and uh, reporters there uh, champing at the bit to uh, ask the, the mayor a variety of questions, not just about the school board issue. Uh, there was a question raised for the newly appointed board members and the mayor wasn't having it. I'm wondering if um, any of the board members can answer this question. Actually, if all of you can, just maybe even just a show of your hands. How many of you support um, taking out a no? We're, no, we're not doing that. We're not doing that. We're not doing that. For a uh -uh. If you have a question for the mayor of Chicago, you can ask me a question. But there, what you are not going to do is litigate what the board has the authority to do once they're appointed. You can ask that once they are appointed. No, I'm not going to do it. It's disrespectful. Do you have a question for me? Okay, I'm sorry. You brought them up here and it is. A do you have ability, a question so. for me? Ask me the question. Okay. He, Ask me if I support. He, he, I'm going to help you out. Yeah. Ask me the question. If I believe that we should invest in our children and make sure we don't lay off brown and black women. Yes. Yes. I'm not going to tolerate cuts. That's what the issue has been in this city. You know what a better question would be? What are you willing to do with your power to ensure that a school district that stuffed black children in Willis wagons? What you should be asking me is, what are you willing to do when you had a district that have laid off black women? 
You should be asking me, what am I prepared and willing to do to ensure that our children get the education that they deserve? Anything necessary. Um, I'm going to ask my own questions. So again, Thank you. Uh, you know, um, the, the, the mayor um, saying that some of the media were being uh, disrespectful and condescending, uh, but then observers looking at the mayor's behavior as disrespectful and condescending. Another question that the mayor was asked, pretty fiery response. <laughs> Um, can you confirm if you're not or are you on leave from CTU? Okay. All right. I'm the mayor of Chicago, you all. I'm the mayor of Chicago. Uh, let, me, let me just, uh, look, I'm trying my best to keep composure for these last 15 months, but the fact that we are still trying to litigate stuff that I already beat. Let me just say this one more time. I already won. I am already the mayor of Chicago. Stop, stop talking old news that nobody even cares about. Not one parent has ever asked me that question. Not one Chicagoan has ever asked me that question. But you know what they have asked me? Will you make sure that the children who are unhoused in this city have an opportunity to lay down their head? That's what they're asking me. Will we have social workers and counselors, Mayor Johnson? My full time and only job is to run this city to love my black wife and my black children. So again, uh, the mayor, <clears throat> pretty, uh, pretty fiery responses, but uh, most interesting was uh, a reporter asking about the mayor's planned trip to London this week. And apparently the Bears are gonna be playing over there as well. Uh, you'll hear the question and then Mayor Johnson's response. Mayor, is this a good week to go to London for a Bears game and also who's gonna pay oh, for oh, that trip? Right. Okay. All right, I'm going to London to attract business to Chicago, okay? I'm going to London to attract business in Chicago. Hold, are you going hold, to the hold, game? Hold, hold on a second, because you already know the answer to that. But I just want to make sure that you do the people of Chicago service, because I have to be very honest with you. It's pretty jacked up the way you frame that. Right. It is. It is. It's disrespectful and condescending that the black man is going to London for a game. It's disrespectful. It is. And, and, and people get away with that too much. The governor went to Tokyo. The governor went to Tokyo to attract business. The mayor of Chicago is going to London to attract business. And while I'm there, I'm going to root for the Chicago Bears. So uh, really just a wide ranging interview, lots of questions, uh, something I think uh, really highlighted uh, the character of uh, the media and of uh, Mayor Brandon Johnson uh, and his responses as uh, we watch that saga continue to unfold. Uh, so, of course, the uh, the new Chicago school board being appointed by the mayor just days after the entire school board announced their resignation. And you've got elections coming up for new school board members. Uh, so we'll be seeing all of that play out. It is Illinois in Focus Daily. Be sure to like, subscribe, hit that notification bell and join us each and every weekday morning, bringing you stuff you need to know to get your day going. All right. Get the podcast anywhere you get your podcast to search Illinois in Focus. Don't forget to like, subscribe, hit that notification bell for America's Talking Network on YouTube.